challenges that women and girls face in Nepal is uh, on the domestic front, it's discrimination. On the domestic front, it's discrimination because uh, most women actually, uh, you know, if, if you start from the community level, it's physical battering, you know, uh, sexual coercion, uh, but, you know, and also uh, the burden of work, I think, is totally on women. Even if you are a professional woman, you have to manage your office as well as your house. There's no progress that is made in that level. That's one area. The other area that women face uh, the challenge is if you are a professional woman, the glass ceiling. You know, there are complete absence of women in policy and decision-making positions. And women find it extremely difficult uh, to retain their jobs, to get promotions, to compete with men. So these are, um, I think, some of the challenges. And the biggest challenge I feel uh, that women are compelled to, to tolerate violence is because they lack economic independence. We work a lot with survivors. And the most urgent need of survivors is that they do not have any support system, neither from the state nor from anywhere else. We do keep them in our shelters for six months, but after that they need to be reintegrated, finding a job becoming economically independent uh, and, and and I think the more, most important thing is they also want dignity and respect which is really lacking. So these are what the women that we deal with want.